Hi, today we are going to send without less secure app allow how we have to send the mail. In previous days, the Gmail allow the less secure app. But from May 30th, the Gmail does not allow the less secure app enable. For that, we have to use app password we have to send the mail. In your mail account, you have to go your manage your Google account. In that we have a security option. For example, in your Gmail account does not turn on your two-step verification means we do not send the mail. For that we have to allow two-step verification. Now, I am click my two step verification and get start my two step verification. For verification purpose we have to give the email password. You get your OTP on your registered mobile number. Now I have received my OTP. I am entering my OTP for that verification purpose. Okay, now validating your pin. Now your two-step verification is turned on. Without turn on your two-step verification, the third party does not allow to send the mail. Now I am set up in the two-step verification account. If you are already turn on your two-step verification means you do not do this step. Afterwards, you have to verify with your password for getting the password. Once again, I am verified my account that uh, two-step verification is turned on or not. After that, you have option like app password. Here you have to two-step verification on app password. You can click the app password means for verification you have enter your email password. Now there is an option like select app. In that select app you have option. There are many options. You have choose the custom name. In that custom name we have to enter the name like SMTP. Simple mail transfer protocol for sending the mail. Now we have to generate the password. Yeah, here you get your app password for your device. Afterwards you have copy the password and you have enter the password in your mail functionality code for sending the mail. This is your app password. You can copy that password.
and you can paste your mail functionality code you have written the code now in that code you have to enter the password which password we have generate now we have live demo for sending mail here i am adding some students details like student name date of birth email class section teacher mobile number for example if you are enter your email id means you have enter the valid email id not enter unauthorized email id now i am add the students details for that students details we have send the mail now you can check your mail id which your mail id you are given while registering for example now i am adding a students detail now in that i give some mail id in that mail id you can get the mail for example here the subject is student detail student name testing date of birth and the message like submit the students details successfully based on that we will get mail without allow the less secure app Thank you for watching this video.